He's the most successful biggest loser from season two. He's called the at-home winner. Pete Thomas lost 185 pounds in all and has kept it off now for nearly nine years. He is here to talk about how he kept it off, yes. what he was like before. Now, uh, next to you over here, we have just an amazing picture. As we widen out yeah. here, this yeah. is you and this is also you. Yeah. Yeah. How did you do this? You know, I call that big sexy. You know, I call it because it <laughs> took a lot of work to maintain that big sexy figure. And of course, as you mentioned, it was on the biggest loser. So I was on the show for exactly 62 days, lost 83 pounds in 62 days, and then more importantly, lost 180, uh, actually 102 pounds at home, and then have been able to keep it off for over nine years afterwards. How? Oh, uh, it's it all comes down. You know, you can burn off a lot of weight when you're working out hard, especially when you're in the gym. At home, it's all about the kitchen. You have to learn how to eat right, and eating on the go, especially on the go is really the, the key to my success. And now you're working right now with Pilot Flying J. You Absolutely. would not think that a travel center yeah. truck stop yeah. is going to get into healthy eating. But Absolutely. But they are because we're, we've started an initiative. We want America's drivers to eat healthy and eating healthy on the go is the key. And I, what I practice is I practice the three F's at every meal. And so there's a fluid, a filler, and a feast at every single meal. Every time I sit down to eat, I'm going to have my water or diet pop. Diet water or diet pop. Uh, I'm from the Midwest. We call yeah. it pop. You know. And then I'm going to have a, a filler. It's going to be a vegetable. It's going to be something that fills me up there. And then the feast is going to be my protein. And so that's available at every pilot flying. Jay, you can eat that just about anywhere you go. But it's really in the kitchen, the work that you have to do in the kitchen. I call it managing your mouth. You have to learn how to manage your mouth. Do you do it in successful. any particular order? Yeah, typically. The fluid and the, uh, the fluid is what I have when I start off. So I'm sitting down, I'm filling myself up with some water or diet pop, and then the filler is going to be my salad broth based soup. It's going to be some other vegetables or things like that. It's going to be fruit if you're, if you're happy to, to be eating on the go. And then the feast is the last thing. So as long as you've got those three components, it's really that simple to, to maintain weight loss. And everybody's lost weight. The key is how do you keep it off? And I believe that's the method. For did everybody. you use this to keep it off or oh, yeah. to, to take it off originally, or did Absolutely. you learn this on your own? I learned it on my own. When, when I was there in, in the Biggest Loser environment, basically we worked out really, really hard. Uh, we kept our calories at a certain level and you could eat anything when you're working out incredibly hard. But then in real life, the transition to real life is where I had to develop skills because all different types of people, you know, come to me and ask me for advice. Last week I was uh, on, the, on the Biggest Loser again and a lady behind the scenes, she said, you know, Pete, I've got six kids. I get up at 4.30 in the morning to go into the show. How do I eat? And I tell her, well, these are some basics, but you have to find somebody who eats like you or has a schedule like you and listen to them. It's really nutrition is a personalized process. You can't just listen to somebody who's 6'5 and how they eat. You have to have some strategies, and that's what we give to and people. And pure pressure. That's amazing. <laughs> I can't, uh, this is before and after and yeah. apparently the before. Pete <laughs> Thomas, uh, thank you very much for coming thank in. You. I people appreciate People got some uh, great ideas from that. We'll have more on that Absolutely. on our website, news4sa.com.